don't contribute to the GDP of any, any country and quite significantly in many respects. The biggest thing is the people. Building trust, building cultural confidence in who you are as a city is paramount, regardless of what facilities you have. The second to that to support that conversation you have from, from a communal base or from a person base is definitely the facilities that you have and making sure that you don't over promise and under deliver on your facilities. We see Fl Durban Flow Mart as being not just an event that takes place over four days. We see that as now becoming a flagship program that is, happens throughout the year. So whether it's calling for, for projects to take part, we want to see us uh, using Durban Flow Mart as an anchor event for the year-long program. So hence we see that opportunity for development to take place and for other activities. And it can be nuanced into different types of flum marts because we know that we're dealing with a wide range of, uh, of, of projects uh, resonating with different audiences of different platforms and, and hence there's a need for us to look at having multiple iterations of Durban Flum Mart. Still in the thinking but yes, uh, we've seen Durban Flum Mart being an extremely successful model.